Um, hello, I'm Miriam and I'm with the Love Your Uni camper van at the moment. Uh, it is 9 o'clock at night, we're in the middle of York city centre and we're about to hit the streets of York. 2,400 university students, mainly freshers, are going to be dragged around the streets of York to visit all the different bars before ending up in three different club venues. Now, for I'm here and working with a local church, a local church called G2. Uh, we're, I've got a bunch of students here and we're all going to hit the streets together and our aim is to number one love people by giving them bottles of water to help sober them up and keep them safe on the night out and give them lollipops and things like that. Number two to have a laugh, that's it, to show that the church is present and active at the party not somewhere else and distant. So we want to get to know the bouncers, get to know the students and be a real presence as freshers come into this city. Also I find on nights out this is when you sometimes find some Christians that haven't yet met any others who are out on their nights out and need a bit of encouragement and to connect into local church. And the third thing we want to do is create links with the city. So we want to make sure that every student night, the local church has got a presence there, creating an environment of safety and helping people on their way, making sure they get home well and also showing alternative ways to party. So if we can have loving people, laughter and links, are we really, really happy tonight? I've got just over 300 bottles of water stacked in the camper van. Um, 600 lollipops and about 35 bouncer presents where I've we tied chewing gum and Mars bars together to give the bouncers on the door to give them a bit of a lift as they've got to be the ones standing in the cold. So we'll take the camper out and about, I'll make sure the guys get teas and coffees to keep warm as we hit the streets and we'll do our best until the water runs out to love as many people as possible and to show up for the students to turn up. That's the plan. Tonight but also give you guys some practical training. Has anyone done anything like this before? So I'm just outside a church where Miriam from Fusion has a, her team of volunteers and she's given them a little bit of training before they go out into the streets and they're also going to pray together for the people that they're going to meet tonight. And really the amazing thing about this Fusion van project is that they are training students and young people to be the change that they want to see. So part of the heart behind getting out to where people are already gathering is to just show up and bring something of God to where to what people are already doing and basically bringing the relevance of Jesus being alive into the middle of what's already going on in student culture. So wishing this group of volunteers all the best as they head out into the city of York to love the students and care for those in need. But what's more, this van is travelling around the whole of the UK to every university campus over the next two years. So look out for it because it's coming to a city near you. Hello again, it is the end of the night, it's half past 12, we've given out about 320 bottles of water, there's nothing left, we've given out about 600 lollies, um, we've probably come into contact with, if there are about 2,400 students out in the city, we've come into contact with certainly hundreds of those. We've had, a, out of our team of about 20 students, half of them put their hands up to say that people had asked them whether they could come to church and given them contact details. Um, we've helped people that have been totally off their faces and also those that really wish they weren't on the night out. I think that's the start of something for us. We've had a brilliant night, definitely ready for sleep, and basically the need just keeps coming. <laughs>